Hey guys, what's up? Multi PS3 Gamer here again, and welcome back to another M Creator tutorial. Today, we are going to be making a mod uh, that a lot of people have been requesting. I just haven't been able to do it because M Creator has been a little weird for me. But now, since the new update for 1.8.9 came out, um, M Creator 1.6.5, I should say, I I can do it now. So we are going to make a dimension. Um, if you do follow me on my M Creator videos for the Captain America Civil War mod that I'm making, uh, there is a new video coming out later this week. Um, and also, I will be using, uh, the block, the vibranium block that I made, uh, to make the dimension, because I figured that'd be cool. So, let's go ahead and get into this. So the first thing we need to do, obviously, is go to workspace and add new element or mod element. And then you want to click on dimensions. And then we're going to name our dimension. Hmm. Let's name it the cool zone. All right. So we named our dimension or our mod dimension. And now we got to figure out what block we want our portal frame to be. So we have a, a, a cluster of options that we can pick from. I think that since I'm working on the, uh, or I said this already, that I'm working on the mod, reduce vibranium block as the portal frame. So just like you make another portal, that's what you're gonna, that's what you're gonna use to uh, make the outline of the portal, like this red box right here. All right, so our portal particles so instead of uh, it being purple particles that fly out we're actually gonna make it something different um, let's see what do we want it to be let's let's have it as let's see what what, what can we do that I guess would be cool um, what about a hearts like hearts come out like when you make an animal in Minecraft have a child, a circle of life. Um, yeah, okay. So that's that's what our particle particles are gonna be. So if you have your particles on, that's what you'll be able to see coming out of the portal. Now, for the portal sound, I want it to be a portal sound. So scroll down to, or up, I don't know, I think I passed it. Where it says portal. Okay, so the portal sound. So when you go in it or when you're by it, this is what it sounds like. So we wanted to have it sound like a portal. Now, for the custom portal igniter name, let's let's make it the bullet that we made. Uh, you can do any texture you want. Oh, hi Nathan. He's playing Rocket League. Uh, yeah, but you can have it any. Uh, name you want any texture but for right now we're just gonna do a bullet so let's do the cool zone igniter and then uh, actually I love this bullet as the custom portal texture uh, portal texture that is, I'm pretty sure, inside the uh, portal, so right here. But we have to import a texture. I don't really have a texture, so we're going to see if we can, uh, I guess I put that in there. Uh, but if you have a certain texture that you want it to be inside, um, go ahead and import it just like a normal item. Uh, I guess we're just going to do the vibranium block. Actually, let's... Since it's going to be the vibranium block for the portal texture, why don't we change this portal frame to something else? Because that's going to get a little confusing. So let's make it a block of diamond. Alright, now that we're done with that, on to the next thing. So, world gen type. Do you want it to be a normal world? Uh, or a dimension? Do you want it to be like the nether? Or do you want it to be like the end? And it gives you examples right here. This is what a normal world looks like. It's like the dirt and then stone and the caves. Nether is just all nether brick. Well, it's not all nether brick because you can pick the blocks you want. Um, 
And yeah, or you can have it like the end. I want I want it to be like the end because I think the end looks really cool. And then the main block that will fill everything, uh, it's like grass or dirt uh, for the floor, just like a normal Minecraft world. So we're going to have it as something interesting. Let's have it as slime blocks because slime blocks are cool. Now, fluid. Fluid is obviously like water that generates into like lakes, rivers, oceans, etc. Uh, so what do we want for our liquid? Um, let's just do... Hmm. Since we don't have any custom uh, liquid textures, I guess, imported, we're just going to... Let's, let's make it lava, flowing lava. Uh, secondary filler blocks. So this is like a second layer under our slime blocks. So let's start make our, our dimension rich of... We'll do gold. Now, if it says these next two options are for nether type only, if you're making a nether world gen, you can choose these, um, and that will be the filler block also, or a third layer, I guess, or nether type only, like quartz, for, uh, for example. That's what you could pick. You might be able to do this for any other, uh, generation like a normal or end like I'm doing the or stuff not exactly sure so I'm not gonna mess with it uh, but you wanted to you want to base your dimension off some type of biome and I think we're gonna uh, base our biome off of the Mesa so for the fog and air color you can choose what kind of color the fog is or the air so say I want it to be a dark red so it's like all scary and mysterious I guess uh, so I'll pick a red color and if you don't want any fog well I guess you can just hit reset and then hit OK maybe I don't, that's, I don't know if you don't want any fog or air color then just don't mess with that uh, can respawn here yes so you can set your home there or something. Has fog everywhere. If you wanted to like say or what I said where it's every, everything's like there's fog everywhere. There's like a clear or white color of flog. Fog. But we have ours red so we're going to make it yes because I want to see fog everywhere. Light settings. Um, do you want this dimension to be totally dark? Like there's absolutely no light luminance anywhere except for the light that you put down um, and we're going for a dark mysterious cool zone so you can chill out or anything so we're gonna make that a dark zone so we're done with that part now here comes the part where if you are good with uh, schematics and stuff you can put your own uh, uh, world structure and like a, a, a house or something that spawns anywhere I have not figured that part out yet um, so we're just gonna have ours normal we don't want any structure spawning and if we want a structure spawn and you're good with schematics go ahead be my guest add a new structure but we're just gonna skip this step for now so to make the bullet or uh, igniter you want we're gonna make it where you have to have a black wool in the center and then it's surrounded by gray wool because that's what it looks like. All right, so now that we have the whole uh, igniter uh, crafting recipe, we're gonna go ahead and hit next and let that recompile because the cool zone is complete so i'm gonna let this recompile and then i'll be right back when i come back we'll be in the world and we'll be putting the box down to go into the cool zone so i'll be right back all right so we are back in the world of minecraft and just to prove that i fixed the gun texture i'm gonna go ahead and prove you guys for bucky 
Boom. Boom. All fixed. Doesn't shoot like a freaking maniac. I know this has nothing to do with the video that I'm currently on. And why am I almost dead? Yeah, but just to prove that it does work. Boom. For some reason the sound is working, but I, I, I can fix it. Boom. You just got your face wrecked. Alright. Enough of that. Let's go ahead and get the cool zone igniter. And, and see that it does make the cool zone thing. I don't know why I looked up zoo. Because I was thinking about zone. Alright. You know what? No, no, no. We're going to do this in survival just to prove it to you guys. That this is possible and I'm not an idiot. Just as soon as I... I'm an idiot. Just as soon as I can reach out on my house. Alright, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Let's get all this XP. Let's put the, the blocks down. The Coolio blocks. I screwed that up. Okay. Uh, next one. I screwed that up. Okay. No, no, no. Did I screw that? Yeah, okay. Mr. Raymond. I screwed that up again. I am an idiot. Okay, this is this is hard. Okay, I'm good. Sam's Sam's trying to make a, another portal and forgot how to make another portal. Oh, uh, rip, 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 rip. Is it like that? I feel like it's taller. Ah, there we go. See, see, I was almost right with that. All right, let's go back into survival. Put that down. Oh my God, look at that. It's got the vibranium blocks in the hearts. Oh God, go in. And we are here. I think the fog is a little too much. But here's your proof. That it is a thing. It's a thing. It's a thing. I'm falling. I died. Oh, we're we here. We are here. We are on the amazing world of Sam. I'm freaking stuck and lagging. Holy lag. Okay, I'm good. Maybe. I don't know. So, just to prove it to you guys that this did work, I'm going to go ahead and fall. Whee! Oh, yeah. Best dimension ever. Oh wait, I forgot we respawn here. Oh god. There we go. Alright, let's make another portal. And no. Alright, I'm good. I'm just lagging real hard because I'm greater lags in Minecraft just because it feels like it. We're okay. We're okay. All right, let's get that those, them diamond blocks and get the cool zone igniter and ignite that portal. Uh, I'm good. I will one day finish this and get back in. Uh, I made it. It's okay, guys. I made it. Now your dimension won't that yeah, bleh, 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 bleh. don't oh god won't be that laggy as mine um I'm creator just lags with yeah that's that kind of stuff but don't worry it, it it works guys I proved everyone wrong I am smarter than you think I am <laughs> okay I'm, I'm, I'm good. all right so we're done with that so um. 
that's all we have for the cool zone dimension. If you guys have any questions, concerns, go ahead and leave a comment down below. And make sure you like this video. I know it's been asked about for a while. But I'm finally making it. So I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope this was helpful. And if you guys have any questions, like I said, go ahead and ask them down below. And I'll try to get back to you. Make sure they're practical questions and have detail. Otherwise, I, it's sort of hard to help you. But yeah, I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.